Fox. I'm sure that was a handball. McDakos crowded, but still managed not just to get boot to ball, but to create something for Bobby Hill. A bounce, a second. Good luck. Across it went just for a moment. Elliott had to work out what was next. It was delivery for Johnson. Bobby Hill, he deserved it. Elliott's leading up, but then splits to become a handball receive option. Receives. This little hit up here could have gone to Ash Johnson. He takes that mark shot on goal. Bobby Hill, back front and centre. Bramble's going to pump it to the contest with a big fly, Lewis! Lewis with the sit, Lewis with the fly, and Lewis chock full of confidence. Swan's dominant in the first minute of this. Campbell picks it up, goes inside 50 to Amadi, swings out of the right boot with a clever centering ball. Oh, Goulden comes in from the side and takes a nice little hanger to get his game going. Terrific mark from Errol Gould. The tall's me a little bit frustrated. The uh, little bloke from the inside the mids comes forward and takes a hanger. Darcy works his way into Phillips. Martin works his way out of trouble, so too does Brayshaw. Kicks over the shoulder and kicks one of the goals of the year. A ripper from Brayshaw. Just watch the intensity and the speed at which Fremantle operate in this board. Stop, it's just great tackle, ruthless around the ball. And a great finish from Brayshaw. Dropped that footy, Amir picked it up. Floats it to the goal square. The Bombers have got the outnumber, but great contest. Amos, a really classy player, summed it up beautifully and got it. In the direction of Tracy. Schultz is going to be dangerous. Look at the attack on the footy from Schultz. Amos, something from nothing again. He's kicked the last two for the Fremantle Dockers. Does he pick it? Maybe. Yes! Superb! How quick was that? Just watch Viney, what he does here to create the space for Cozzy Pickett. Bomber's desperate for a goal through this passage of play. Right stands tall. Had it, lost it. Wealthy. Little shark in play. Stringer on the left boot. It caught it. What's Jake? So it Canada does. Jake Stringer, he continuously is able to do the unconventional. What a privilege it is to be standing here, carrying on the legacy of our great mate Spud. Look around you. This is a proud football community. Everyone in this stadium and watching from home has shown up for this important cause. We want to invite everyone into the huddle for this important message. Being here tonight, or watching on from home, this is a reminder that we have each other's backs. Let's wrap our arms around one another and the community. Like Anita said, you're not alone. Thank you for showing up for your mates, your family, and for Spud. Let's roll up the sleeves and get to work. To Papley. McInerney's in a dangerous area. Throws his boot at it. It's bouncing. It's through. Another one as they're a kick short of a double ton. McLean. From almost point blank range, check sides it through. What are we seeing at the SCG? The Swans crack 200. No time to lose. Sloan, there's a way forward. Oh, Taylor man. Walker is one on one with Maynard. Uncomfortable for Brad Maynard. The coast is clear. And the Tex will relish this. They're not dead yet. These are late crows. The wrestle is on. Everyone watching the clock, those that can see it, 
20 precious seconds. Go forward, Adelaide. O'Brien does. We wait for the bounce. Here's Dawson at his hundredth. Toppled over by Isaac Prater to Jeremy Howe. Welcome back to the big time, Jeremy. He's kicked at the Hoskin Elliott. It's a winter classic. 